Hello, Frontline Teach. My name is Val Soul. I'm the instructor for Frontline Teach, uh, and this uh, is our course overview where I'm going to tell you a little bit about our program and what you can expect. So Frontline Teach is, uh, the teach piece stands for Treatment Education Activists Combating HIV. Um, and this is one of the courses in our series of teach classes, Project Teach, Teach Outside, and Frontline Teach. Project Teach and Teach Outside are both classes for folks living with the virus. Frontline Teach is a class for people on the quote-unquote front lines of the epidemic. So family, friends, service providers, or people who work in the field, community activists, basically anyone who wants to learn more about HIV. Um, uh, if someone listening today is HIV positive, you're definitely welcome here. Uh, but just keep in mind that uh, this course is going to uh, pull back a little bit from uh, doing direct service provision. Um, if you have any questions about this, you can contact the AIDS library or my contact information will be at the end of this presentation. Our goals here are, are ambitious. We're trying to create treatment education activists um, and we want everyone who goes through this program not just to use the information for themselves but actually to teach 10 people. Each one teach 10. Uh, which is a lot. Um, and this is a community leadership course, um, and anyone who is taking the time to learn more about these um, issues and who commits to being in the class and to our, our goals of teaching 10 other people uh, is a leader. Uh, you are already leaders. Um, and we want you to pass this information on to people in your communities, particularly people who wouldn't necessarily come and find a class. Um, and we know that the if we just do education without doing it in a realm of empowerment, without giving people empowerment um, in order to put the education into place, it's it falls flat. Um, so we want to pass on both education and empowerment to you, and we want that you to pass that on to others. So we're going to definitely be talking a lot more about what that looks like uh, throughout the course of the class. Um, and no one here knows it all. Uh, we build on uh, each other's knowledge, and we build on each other's experiences, um, and we use uh, certain models um, that mean that we all bring something to this class. Everybody here has something to teach. Um, we're going to rely on your stories um, and the things that you tell us. Um, so well, something that's really important in this class is to learn from your classmates and not to prejudge based on what you think their past experience might be or if you have a hard time with someone one day uh, don't discount them forever in the future because they might surprise you. Um, the other thing is that anecdotal evidence has always been important in the in the epidemic of AIDS uh, and people comparing notes, getting together, touching base and figuring out that they were both going through the same thing has actually led to revolutionary changes in the epidemic. So we'll we'll cover that more in in the future too. Just know that your stories are important to, to me and to everybody in this class. So everyone in the class is going to get to contribute. If you disagree with someone says, address the issue, not the individual. Um, and we don't want to have any attacks on personality here. We're going to have a lot of different types of people in this class, and we want everybody to be respected for who they are. We're here to pull each other up, not push each other down. Uh, like I said, we work in a cir circle of learning. Um, and this is going to be the first time that I've ever taught an online course. And uh, so there's a there's a, a sort of formative document called the Core Rules of Netiquette that we're going to use uh, if there are um, sort of uh, online on, online communicating can be very difficult um, and so we're going to use the core rules of netiquette to keep ourselves on track. Uh, now a lot of what we're talking about in this course are treatment decisions. Um, the only one who can decide things for you is you um, and the only thing uh, the only person who can decide things for a person living with HIV or AIDS is that person. So 
we in Frontline Teach want to help you support the people living with HIV and AIDS that you know in decisions that they might have to make, but we're not trying to give you power over their decisions. We're not trying to give you information so that you can tell them what to do. We're trying to give you information so that you can help people sort through their priorities and their goals and make the treatment decisions that work best for them. So some of our goals here, uh, similar to Project Teach, we want to build a frame for learning about living with HIV, create supportive networks, enhance our relationships, create a safe space, separate good in information from HIV on HIV from the rumors about HIV, uh, find answers to questions that you might be coming in with, learn more about area resources, and build better listeners and communicators. Now here are some anti-goals. We're not going to teach you to diagnose conditions. We're not going to teach you to give out medical advice. We can't do that. This isn't a replacement for medical advice. This isn't a replacement for medical school. This is a treatment education program. We're also not going to teach you to tango. Um, and if that's what you came here looking for, then uh, let me know and we'll uh, get you in contact with some other resources that might serve you better in that way. Uh, we are going to address topics in the following areas. Treatment education, secondary prevention, issues and resources, and communication skills. And our ground rules here, respect each other, respect yourself, and respect our time together. Um, and on the, on the Moodle homepage, you will see more about our ground rules. The bottom line, you can do this. Just keep coming back. And don't take yourself out of class. You know, if you're struggling, maybe there's something that we can help you with. Um, uh, if you're struggling to keep up with the work, let me know, um, and I may be able to pace it differently for you or work with you one-on-one -on -one, um, so that you can keep up. You've got to remember that we've seen it all. Um, the instructors of Project Teach have been doing this since 1996, and there is no story that we haven't heard about a hardship in someone's life. So uh, there's nothing, Yeah, you know, well, uh, you might want to try to stump us. That would be kind of fun. But um, in terms of barriers that you might be going through, other people have gone through those same barriers and other people have finished. So you can too. Uh, we want you to take what's useful to you in this class. Um, and if something's not useful to you, then let it fly. Um, uh, you know, uh, let it wash over you and, uh, uh, you know, come back for the next class when something might be more useful to you. Make sure your questions get answered. Um, and we might say, you know, that's a piece of curriculum that we'll cover in the next week or in two weeks. Um, so... Uh, we want to make sure that your questions get answered. And you might want to keep track of questions that you have um, and see, you know, compare once a week or so and see if they've gotten answered. Um, and keep in touch with me. Here is the my contact information. Like it says, I'm so glad you're here. Uh, thank you for signing up to learn more about HIV and AIDS. Uh, and I hope that this course is instructive for you. Uh, I welcome your emails and your comments.